Okay, so <laughs> the, with the battery cut out there. Right, so I've did it again. Uh, I uh, moved the diode away from its. I already had uh, snipped it, as you see. If you could see that between the wires, I snipped the uh, diode 99, just under the crystal board. So I moved it away with the tweezers again, so it wasn't uh, in circuit. But I broke circuit and I put the uh, crystal board back in again at the top here. There we go. Uh, crystal board back in again. And uh, the diode that I've uh, took out of circuit, I just uh, snipped it with a pair of snippers. Yeah. I used them. Um, see that? Snip, 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 snip. So, I mean, it can be reattached by a, a, a soldering iron. Just give it a solder and it's contacted again. Uh, right, when I did this the first time, obviously you've got, uh, is it six? I can't remember. Uh, six, six, I think it's, no, it's seven. Seven pins on this side over here, and there's three pins on this side. Now, when I put this crystal board back in, Obviously, I got the, the seven pins in, but on the bottom side here, I didn't match up uh, the other three. So that's why I wasn't receiving anything uh, through the radio. I hadn't aligned the pins. So that's properly aligned. Okay. Now it's three in the morning. Only half past three. So, I'm not going to expect to hear anything. But it does work now. So the power's turned right up. And the drive is right up. Now this radio will only hit about 60 or 80 watts. Um, it used to do 100 many years ago. Uh, but something happened to it many years ago. It's uh, 20 years old. Right, so this is uh, as it should be. Oh, deal. Oh, deal. Let's be a bit closer than that. Oh, deal. Oh, deal. Oh, deal. Oh, deal. Okay, that's it in full. Now, without turning the mic, without turning, see that just down, without having to turn the mic down, just leave the mic full up and turn the drive down now, which is the, the other one, turn the drive down. You can uh, vary the output on single sideband between 250 milliwatt and 100 watts or whatever the radio goes to maximum anyway and, th and this one doesn't go to 100 any longer so we'll just put it halfway down and try it now look at the power meter now oh deal oh deal it's just slightly uh, down oh deal right, so just down a little bit yeah. Deal. And it's right down now. Oh deal. Oh deal. Just keep it up. Oh deal. Oh deal. Oh deal. So you, you can vary the, uh, the single sideband output using the, the drive, uh, just like you can do it with AM, FM and carrier wave. Turn that up a little bit.
tune this. Odd deal. So that's about 20. Odd, maybe 25. Odd deal. Odd deal. Odd deal. Obviously it wouldn't move. Turn it up a little bit. Audio. Oh, Audio. So there you go, it is. It's barely moving now. Audio. So there you go. It does work. It does work. It's just um, I didn't have the pins aligned properly on the on the crystal box. So there you go. I've had that for uh, 20 years now, since 1991. I didn't even know that. Things you find out. Actually, I thought it was a somebody at it and kidding on. Because uh, it didn't work the first time. It's my superstar there. It didn't actually work the first time, so... There you go. Uh, I don't know if I can actually... I'll probably get a lot of feedback. Turn the squelch up. Probably going to get a lot of feedback trying to listen to this. Well, let's take it down anyway. Terrible when you haven't got a tripod, isn't it? Right. And shift that wee bit. Can't see what I'm doing. Right. Okay. Oops, that should be at a zero at the end. Right, I think we're ready now, eh? Finally. Um, now I've got the power right down. Well, I've not got it right down, but a fair wee bit. You're probably only going to get feedback out it. Cannot see. Hang on. Right, might be quick because that's almost ten minutes recording time.